Hello and welcome back to the Battle for Westnoth, where we are playing the uh, Southgard campaign. We're doing pretty well here, as uh, as you can see on the map. We have been pushing back the undead on the east side of the map. Uh, and on the west we're holding our own, I think we only have a couple of uh, enemies here to take care of. Now they keep sending reinforcements from the south, so that is continuing stream of units. That's the green the green units here. On the east side, as I said, we have the undead, and they're getting, uh, well, more money from these villages. We should really take care of that and take them. What I'm worried about here is that we are 14 turns into 28 turns, and what we have to do, let's take a look here. We have to bring Ethiliel to Membrane's village, and that's down here, and she is up where? Here. So that is going to take quite a while. 14 turns seems like a lot, but uh, if you have to fight your way through every brigand here, it's going to be a problem. So, uh, hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure if I need to take this out. If I can control him by taking the villages, maybe that's what we do. We'll see how it goes. Right here, I only have... I can only move one unit, I guess. I moved everybody else last turn. We can buy a unit 17 here. Maybe I'll do that now. If I recruit somebody here. I could recruit another cavalryman. Those are good because they're fast and we can maybe clear the way for Ethelial to get down there to Mebrin's village. Alright, let's 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 go with that and we'll see what happens. It is morning now so the they're going to have a disadvantage here. The um, skeletons and the brigands. Uh, He's attacking over there. Good. We did pretty well. Oh, that's good. Our peasant is hanging in there. And we have some good units, some upgraded units over here, it looks like. And they're bringing up more. Yep, as we suspected. Good. Okay, so both Ethelial here and... and Minister Hylas do provide eight in healing to any adjacent unit. There, yep, you can see heals eight, so that's good. Hmm. Well, let's see what we're gonna do on uh, on the east side first of all. I think I want to bring down these units quickly and take over these villages. Let's do that. Maybe I can stop them from uh, spawning more units here, or slow it down at least. Can we take care of this one? Revenant, he has 16 hit points left. We'll bring up uh, Hylas here behind them, but I think I'll go ahead and do a ranged attack here in the afternoon. Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of damage. He's down to 10. Here is a Javelinier, and he has two attacks with a Javelin. That is good. He could kill him. And he did. Oh, excellent. Let's bring up Hylas behind him there. And then, uh, well, we'll take... He has 17 hit points. Full hit points there. We'll take our Merman down here. He can't do much, actually, but we'll bring him down there. Here we have to push ahead pretty aggressively, I think. But we have a, what is it, a thug? He only has a melee weapon. And then we have a, another thug. Okay, that means any archer style unit here should be able to do well. We are healing with Sir Garrick. Okay, we'll maybe do that, continuing that. All right, let me take my Master Bowman here first. Who should we try to kill? He is in a village. Okay, maybe we'll take this one here. 14, we can maybe kill him. Oh yeah, no problem at all. Then the problem is, what do we do here? He is a thug in a village. It's hard to take him out. As you can see here, uh, first strike. Well, decent chance. Maybe what we'll do is we'll take, bring down this one here. That's a level two. Let's take him first. Oh, there, 10. Only 10 damage, okay. The next one, let's have him attack as well. Nine, good, one more. Oh, no, okay. Well, let's uh, maybe bring down our cav unit 40%. There. He's not the best in this kind of terrain, is he? So maybe that was a mistake to build by him. He could have been better used. Well, if we get through here, then he can ride down fast. We'll keep him in, in the back here, maybe. I think I'll take my peasant. You know what? I think I'll take this unit, uh, Sir Garrick here as well. Put him behind the peasant. Peasant will get a bonus then. Let's see here. Pitchfork. Uh, well, how much does he have? 12 left. 
You can see here, 25 and 50, so he gets a big bonus. We have 16% chance of killing this unit. Let's do that. Well, let's try anyway. Oh, we did. Excellent. And now we can take this village. Uh, who should do that? Well, we have another peasant here. I think I'll take him. Well, he's healed, isn't he? 19 out of 19. Who needs healing? Nobody that can move, actually. All right, so in that case, let's move the peasant up here and defend here against incoming. Push out our border, maybe. So who needs healing? Well, these back here. I'll move uh, Ethelial. She needs a little bit of hit points there. She can heal these units. That looks pretty good. I think I'll take my cav unit anyway down here. They can't reach him. No. Maybe he can pave the way for them there later. Okay, so I think we are good to go for the next turn. 15 already. Yeah, he got another unit there. Okay, they're attacking the peasant. We did pretty good damage though. That's not bad at all. So they have four units there now. I need to push ahead, I think. Now we are at dusk. Nobody gets a bonus, but look at all those uh, he that healing we got. Here is a skeleton archer. We should probably... Hmm. Can we go down now? We can't go all the way to that village. Not here either, but look at this. There's nobody here. I think I'll bring them down here. And they can spread out and take over as much as possible. That will stop the blue units from propagating there. All right, should we just hang back here a little bit? How much healing do we need? Healed, healed, well, he needs a little bit. Mostly healed here. So we could go down, but I think I'll wait there. Do we need three units plus Hylas here? I think so. We'll leave them there. Maybe they can deal with them and then and the, the uh, Longbowmen here, the two of them can spread out and take over here. That is pretty good. Okay, so what do we do here? Well, they received quite a bit of healing. We should bring her down there, I think. Well, now they can't get... Can anybody get through past her? No, not really. We'll put down our... Uh, peasant here maybe and we'll put this guy in front as well then everybody else can come up behind wait I want my better units there to get healed there uh, that is a melee unit I think I'll put him here in the village and we'll put Sir Garrick well I was gonna put him up here so he can get healing but let's put him back there something like that should we get another unit maybe I'll get another one Oh, hmm. The cavalryman is fast, though. I'll, I'll take another one of those. And then we'll move up Sir uh, Doran here so he can uh, help out. I don't think he's going to die. He's behind the front line there. Stay with these here. Is that good? I think that is okay. We'll, prob well, we'll move down, maybe. Move down one there. Something like that. We'll see what they're going to do, what, who they're going to attack. And that would be... Turned 16 already. Yep, the peasant, sure enough. Although we did two damage there, that's good. They're gonna kill this, probably. Ooh, yeah, he died. But that's all they could do. Ethelial now, can, I could maybe have her squeeze around there. All right, healed back up, good, good news. Huh, hmm, so we need to take out these four. They're in the mountains there. Maybe we'll just move on down and we'll wait because right now it is first watch and that's a bad time for us. What if I go down? How far can she get here? I want her close. Hmm. Yeah, if I put her here, that's going to be a gap there, but I'll put my cav unit here. He's bad in the forest, but we'll see if they attack him instead of anybody else. Um... Put her there, maybe. Yeah, let's do that. Now, I can attack here. We'll do that. A longbow. Warm him up a little bit, and he, now he's down to 14. And we only have a sword here. 50-50. Yeah, we'll do more damage. We could potentially kill him, right? Yeah, 31% chance. Let's try that. One more hit. Yes, we did it. Okay, good. Here's a cav unit behind the line, and... Uh, this is a spearman. He can do... He can use his javelin here. Well, not much, but 
It's a little bit. We'll put him here, and Sir Garrick then can heal in the village. And here's our new cav unit. Bring it down here. So what I'm trying to do is push down here and just basically ignore them. See what we can do to take out... Well, leave one or two units behind there. Oh, they're bringing one up here to stop us from taking over. Maybe. Okay. That merman is basically useless there. We'll bring them down here. So now he's losing villages. He has three left there. That's what it looks like. Yeah, I think so. Now, can we take out this guy here at night? He has a fist and a bow. I think I want to do that. I think I want to leave him like that. And then we'll Sir Hylas back here. Yeah. That looks good to me. Let's uh, go on to turn 18. It's not looking good time-wise. That's all I'm worried about here. I think we're going to defeat them, but is that going to be enough time? All right. Okay, good. Use his spear and hit him. Try to take out my spearman over there. And now my cavalryman is blocked. Okay. But, look at that. They're moving up here. That's pretty good. All right. We should probably take over another village here. Um, hmm. We'll go down there. So now he is over there, and it is, what is it now? It is second watch. Okay, so we'll probably just stay here. Well, I can use my pitchfork. No, <laughs> he has a bow. That's not a good idea. Let's just stay here then, and we will see what we need to do. Well, he has another bone shooter at level two. Hmm. He might kill one of my units here. All right. And there are two footpads here. They're both a club and a sling. But we're not going to attack them in this turn. So on the west side, what do we do? There's a poacher. These two here, that's a melee-only unit. And here's a poacher. Okay, what if I take... Well, this one here is not doing well, is it? I don't think I want to attack here. I want to sit tight. Instead, we'll move him out of the way. I think behind here. Let's do that. And I'll wait with my archers as well. Okay, so um, she's hanging back here. She could move up to heal, but I want to push back down, right? 5, 3, 4, 2, but we have 40% chance. That's not very good odds. I think I move her back here, because there's not that many units back here. So what if I do... No, don't want to do any... Well, 70% chance here, but he has four attacks. I think I'll wait. We'll sit tight there. Can he move? He can't really move out of the way. Move him down here, and uh, this is Doran. Yeah, move him there. And they can't get to my spearman. Later on, we can move him down and get healing from Ithilmiel, maybe. Okay, that is all I want to do, I think. Yeah, let's go with that. Moving on to turn 19. So. Oh, he killed the archer there. Hmm, unfortunate. And my, ca my cab unit there is... Dead. <laughs> Taking a lot of damage. Mm, but we have stronger units there, I feel. Now, finally, Dawn here. Okay, good. And it looks like Sir Garrick is in good shape here, so we could probably move up and see if we can take care of. Uh, well, if I attack here, 9 2. Let's try that. Oh, 9 nothing. Okay. Hmm, what do I do with my Spearman? I think I'll move him back, actually. They might try to kill him, but uh, so be it. We'll keep these two back. Can I move her down? I can move her a little bit down. They are bringing in more units, and I don't want her to go by herself. So let's see what we can do against this guy here. My level uh, two. Yep, level two. Eight, four. Yeah, let's try that. That's good. Uh, 16 damage. He's down to 17 now. Cav will do that as well. Six left. I should have actually started with her because she has that magical attack. Um, hmm. Six, three. What is he? There. He has five left. Let's do that. There. She. Oh, he died. Good. So now we should. Yeah, we should be able to move up a little bit at least, but uh, the turns are running out. What do we do? Well, I'll move over here, I think. And then we'll go ahead and do 30%. Okay. Come on, one hit. Nothing. Move him down here and then attack there. 
Yeah, 12. Good. And 12. Too much to ask for it to kill him, but uh, not too bad, actually. And now they have the bone shooter here, and they killed my archer, or my, not my archer, my peasant there. If I were to attack him, 50-30, um, ooh, that's not great. We'll probably back down a little bit here. I think so, and then Hylas can be back there, and then we'll bring in our merman a little bit later on, so those units can defend against them while we clean up here. You should slow him down in getting units, I would think, right? He has two left here if he doesn't take one from us, he, which he could do, but I doubt it. He's going to attack us, I bet. Okay, so what do we do here? Do we attack here? Well, we could move this unit up there. I think I'll do that, and then we'll do a longbow attack there. There, we took care of him, so there's only two poachers left there. This is Doran. We don't want him to die. If he goes up here and attacks, 6-3... Pretty decent. We'll give that a shot. Yeah, 12 damage. Not bad. Down to 10 hit points now. So should we really leave these two here? We could probably take Sir Garrick up, right? If I take Sir Garrick here and do use the glaive, yeah, let's try it. 10 damage. 20 damage. Good. This might be enough to take care of them. And we have three units here. Two helpers here for Athelio. The cav unit should gain 8 back. That's good. Okay, I think that's it. Let's go to the next turn. Oh, he's heading up to take care of our... Uh, take our... Our villages up there. Hmm. Oh, we have to see what happens there. Okay, poacher coming up to merman. Okay, not too bad. Okay, we got some healing back, but... Uh, he's gonna take over here, isn't he? And I don't have no units to help out. No cav, nothing up there. And this is going to take too long to get up there. Hmm. We can basically ignore it and head on south. We're not going to buy any units anyway. We're just going to push ahead to here, to the village. So maybe we'll do that. We have an open road here, basically down. Where do we put her? Hmm. Now, he can reach. If she goes down here, he can reach her, but maybe that's okay. Move her down here now. Hmm. Maybe here. We'll ignore that village for now. Now, there, is, there are two poachers here. One there. Sir Garrick should be okay. Let's try this here. Pitchfork? Yeah. One more. There we go. Excellent. And here is our spearman. We'll move him up here. Maybe he can go up here and try to take out that archer. Maybe. Sir Garrick, mm, bring him down, and then we'll try to take out the poacher here. Yep, we did. Good. So that means my cav unit, well, there's nobody threatening him. We'll go back, we'll go here, and then we'll see if we can meet up with Athelial and she can heal him. That would be the best. Let's just see if we can attack here. Longbow, sword, 15-2, I will do longbow. There we go. Good. One left here. Um, hmm. I probably can't kill him. It's a level two. Move him down here and take over another village is probably better. So there's a bone shooter coming down. There is also this poacher, this footpad. Who is not great, right? So maybe I'll move up and see if I can, between the two of them, here, attack and kill him. 30% chance. Oh, 10. Good. 20. Okay. What about the merman here? Can we get kill, a kill here? Maybe. Yes, we did. Excellent. Merman Hunter level 1 uh, has tw 21 XP. Good. That's excellent, actually. Hylas. We can move down Hylas, I think, and help out here, right? We can also go up here and see if we can... Uh, Hmm, I don't know if I should try to block this skeleton archer from taking over. I could take my javelinier level 2, we'll go through the mountains. You know what, I might do that. And we'll bring down Hylas to the village instead. Yeah, we'll do that. That looks good to me. Okay, um, that's all I can do, I think, yeah. Let's go for the next turn. Yeah, he took a village there. Yeah, not good. And there are two poachers left here. Bringing up 
another footpad there. Okay. So what, what can we do? Can we kill them outright? Ah, oh, we can't reach. We can reach here, though. Let me see here first. Can I go? No, I can't. Hmm. You know what? I may be tempted here, actually, to put... Go back with these units now. One at least. Hold off this bone shooter instead. With Hylas and this uh, level 3 Master Bowman. And here we have a bodyguard and our Javelinier. Okay, so now I think I'll take him. Javelinier goes up here and engages the Skeleton Archer. What about the Elvish Bodyguard? Maybe the same. Bring down the Merman, because the only time he's going to be useful is down here. Maybe we can get him down, although we're on turn 21 already. Hylas, uh, oh, there's a bunch of the... Yep, that's right. We'll leave him here together. That's fine. And then this unit, yeah, I think I'll have to go and attack here. 15-3, yeah. Hmm, 30% chance of hitting now. We have to kill him now, right? Because he's going to gain... I did 15 damage. He has 18 left. So we have to put in an effort here. Yes, we took care of him. Good. So now... Hmm, what should I do? Should I take this... I want to take the village, right? I don't want this po this footpad to take it. But then Ithilia is by herself. He is a level 2 swordsman. Move him down. Hmm, that's tricky. She can go down here and help out. But then... They can attack her, can they? No, they can't attack her with this unit. Only with this one. If I do that, what can I do? Magical, 70% chance. Um, hmm. And he can't reach. <laughs> but I only have seven turns left. I have to take care of them now. Really, these units have to rush down. They really can't spend any time here. What about my... Oh, hmm, he can't do much. Nope. Uh, and over here we are good to go, but kind of late in the game to bring them up. Look at Sir Garrick, how slow he is in the mountains there. Alright. So, I should probably take this unit down and make way for her. And then they have to take... they can take that village, maybe. Come on, hit him. Not... yeah, one time. Now I took two villages. Okay, the footpad moved out. That's actually good. But can I really reach down here? There are two poachers now. They're in our way. And it's dusk. I have to defeat this one. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. Nothing. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll go with the uh, longbow. Come on, kill him. No. <clears throat> but look at that. He is now level 3, fully healed. That's going to help us a lot, won't it? And I think... Uh, well, actually, I should move her down. And we can, we can do the snare slows. How much does he have left? Oh, he has fully healed. Okay. But what if I do... And snare? Let's do that. And then we'll attack here. He's going to be healed by her anyway. Ah, there we go. So he's down to 8. He's down to 9. We can kill him next turn. And he hasn't. Uh, doesn't have any more units coming up. Here we have a problem, though. They're going to keep attacking, and uh, we should uh, most likely die, right? Can I reach anybody here? I can reach with this Master Bowman here. Let's see. Yeah, we'll have to attack here. Come on, one hit at least, nothing, okay. So Garrick is not the fastest, is he? Alright, let's move up here and protect what we have. Um, there, that's good. Okay, well wait a minute, I shouldn't take the merman there. I should probably see if I can get rid of this bone shooter here. It is dusk, right? Yeah, it's dusk. So if I do Hylas here, Magical, 13, I think I'll do that first. Only one attack there. Okay, and we'll do a Longbow. Ooh, that's nasty. We'll do a Sword instead. But now he's down to 6 hit points. 
What about the merman here? Can he actually do anything? It's, it's bad. The odds are not good here. Uh, mm, no, we're gonna wait. We we'll, won't put him there. Wait a minute. Hylas is down to five hit points. I didn't even see that. Um, well, that's gonna be interesting. We might be in trouble here. Can he reach? No, he can't. Okay, we'll see what happens. Five hit points. Uh, this could be the last turn. Let's uh, go with the next turn. Oh. <laughs> now I will never see Weston free again. Remember, guys, this is one of our criteria. We can't lose Minister Hylas. And so we are defeated. I think. Turn 22. Let's look. We would have made it down here, I have a feeling. If you look at the map, here is Athelial. She can go pretty far, and we could have kind of skipped any unit he would have come up with there. One, two, three, four. It would have been right on the, well, maybe turn 27 we would have made it. But uh, unfortunately, Hylas died. So that's the end of the campaign, the South Guard. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Uh, check out my other videos, and I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, guys, this is Time and Tactics. Thank you very much for watching the video. It sure helps me out a lot. If you'd like, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and or that like, and I will see you in the next video.